testified it was in the latter part of 1977 that this took place. Tantol, you, you might recall, um, initially testified um, in this courtroom that he was arrested in uh, mid-June 1977 and the event relating to the dry was about one month later. And I would submit to your honors that that uh, testimony uh, is more reliable uh, than what we heard when the defense tried to question him about whether it was jackfruit season or not. A witness is never going to forget coming upon a mass grave of hundreds of killed people who had just been in the prison. I cannot imagine how a witness would remember 30 years later whether or not it was Jack for So. We believe the evidence you've heard is consistent uh, with uh, this telegram having been sent to the leaders in Phnom Penh in June 1977. There needed to be further interrogation of these people. That could have easily taken a long time, given how many. The evidence is inconsistent, is, is entirely consistent that this was the same group of people. Let me turn uh, to Phnom Krall uh, just a few remarks um, because I want to acknowledge uh, the defense seemed to think we're incapable of making concessions and we're not. Um, they pointed out uh, that the evidence regarding killings at Phnom Kaul um, they argued it was not as strong. And we do not dispute that. There is, there is no question uh, that the evidence you heard from Phnom Kral is not of the same quality as what you heard from the other three security centers, where we had multiple corroborating witnesses, admissions of cadres about the killings, and documents. There's no question the evidence from Phnom Kral is not that strong. We did not argue in our brief that there was sufficient evidence of extermination at this particular site. But I would remind you of one of the reasons for this. The, the defense liked to complain about procedures not being able to go out and investigate. Uh, one of the problems we faced with this site uh, was that between 2009 and the investigation finished and we looked through and, and saw the witnesses who had been interviewed, between then and the time we got to trial, we found out that most of, not most, all uh, of the surviving detainees other than uh, the two from the K-17 site had passed away. And so uh, we looked through uh, the list of who was there. Uh, we looked through the list of civil parties. Uh, and there was one remaining uh, possibility who could be called. And you heard from both defense teams complaints about uh, our reliance on the testimony you heard from Sun Vut, the Division 920 soldier. And we asked you to call him, uh, Your Honors, because he was a civil party who had been admitted by the co-investigating judges, specifically in relation to Phnom Krau. He was admitted as a civil party, specifically in relation to Phnom Krau. And you'll see that in the closing order, uh, paragraph 643, footnote uh, 2797. And he said in his civil party application, he was detained at a prison uh, near a mountain in Konek District, which is the district uh, that Phnom Krau was in. We hoped that he uh, had been imprisoned 
in the large, uh, the large prison uh, that, is, that used the name Phnom Kral. You remember the site consists of a number of different offices and buildings. It's rather a confusing crime site. Um, but we were hoping that this was someone who had been detained uh, in this large prison in which hundreds of Division 920 soldiers were uh, um, and I certainly concede that is not where he was detained. Uh, he was detained in a smaller office in the same area, but in a smaller office that was not the, the very big prison. It is, it is for you to decide um, whether the location he was detained is within the scope. And I would submit to you um, that in this area, you heard this evidence, uh, the operations, the security operations, operations in prisons of Division Sector 105 and Division 920 were used interchangeably. Division 920 soldiers were imprisoned at the Sector Phnom Kral offices. So it would be entirely reasonable to conclude that this was part of this network of security offices in this region. But irrespective, irrespective of your conclusion on that, the defense argument that you must simply ignore the testimony of someone is wrong. And I'd comment here on the Kusampan team. They ignore, they ignore a basic distinction throughout their entire arguments, often throughout this trial, on whether facts are part of uh, the crime uh, for which the accused is charged and whether evidence is admissible for other purposes. Sunvut's testimony, whether he was in, in a prison that was part of Phnom Kral or not, is still admissible. It shows the systematic use of torture by this regime by the CPK at its security offices, and that is an issue in this case. And they, time and time again, pretend that this is not the case. I have no doubt your honors can make the distinction between whether uh, an event, a fact, uh, is, is a crime for which the accused can be convicted, and whether an, an evidence that may be not part uh, of, of the specific crime base, but proves the policy. And let me briefly take an aside here um, to address an issue that was raised uh, by the Cusum Pond team regarding trapping uh, They are absolutely right, Your Honors, uh, that Im Chen's statement that Kusum Pond visited uh, that site uh, cannot be used uh, because it is act and conduct evidence. They're absolutely right. Uh, the use of that interview, uh, however, is completely unnecessary to prove this point because Kusum Pond himself has admitted twice that he visited Trapyang Tamo and I would note here that in their day and a half of arguments, the Kusum Pan team entirely ignored this. They didn't say a word about their client's admitted visit to Trapyang Tamo. And let me also make clear that while M. Cham's interview uh, can't be used to prove uh, Q Simpan's visit, uh, it can be used and it is powerful evidence of what Q Simpan or anyone else would have seen when they went to the site. Her description of the conditions at Trapyang Tama is admissible. It is not acts and conduct evidence. And it tells us what Hughes and Pond would have seen when, as he admits, he went to the site. Now let me turn back 
uh, to security offices. And this was the point of my remarks um, where I had expected to respond to the arguments of the defense regarding S-21. But there is a hole here. Because despite having two long days to present their defense, the Nunchea team said hardly a word about what we believe is the most important crime site in this case, and what is, what is certainly the crime site most closely connected to their client, Nunchea, a prison at which 18,000, we now know, were killed. Many under the direct orders of the accused. Is there anyone out there who believes that the Nunche team did not address S21 because they ran out of time? They had three opportunities here to talk about S21, and each time they took a pass. Friday afternoon. They passed on talking about S21 so they could leave 20 minutes early. Monday morning, when we were expecting it to be addressed, they skipped it. And Monday afternoon, they again chose to say nothing and instead uh, threw some more insults our way. What were the pressing important matters they had to talk about instead of S21, the security office overseen by Nunchea? We got two sessions on the crocodile, plan A, plan B, phases one, two, three. We received a lecture on the meaning of communism and another lecture on Western insensitivity to Cambodian culture by an Australian. And we got 47, 47 references to the Manichaean narrative. Nothing about S21, but 47 times they talk about the Manichaean narrative. Nothing about the child prisoners at S21 or Frank there's silence on S21 and the child prisoners, Your Honours, spoke volumes. Perhaps uh, tomorrow they will try to talk about S21 uh, so that no one has an opportunity to respond. Perhaps, and if so, shame on them. So be it. Nothing, nothing they can say changes the evidence that proves their clients' guilt and proves the crimes at the security office. So, we didn't hear about S21, but we did hear about the Manichaean narrative over and over and over. And each of the 47 times they talked about this, it became more and more clear they don't even understand what the term actually means. It's not difficult to explain. What Manichaean actually means is having a dualist view in which you divide the world into good and evil, good and bad. Who, who does that sound like? The greatest irony of these closing arguments is that no one, no one is more guilty of a Manichaean mindset than the Khmer Rouge themselves. The people who divided Cambodia into good elements and bad elements and killed the, those they viewed as bad. That is Manichaean. You heard the lawyers describe the security policy 
made to be a good job of people you buy some the stuff that are called you buy none of bay did they even realize when they were describing the policy of of the CPK this way, they were throwing their own client under the Manikian bus. Your Honours, I'm going to leave uh, some time, uh, 10 minutes, for uh, the National Co-Prosecutor. Uh, I have two uh, more brief uh, issues uh, I would like to make before, uh, before I pass. Uh, the microphone to her. One, a few points in response to the issues that were raised regarding the accused criminal responsibility. Why, why are Noon Chea and Kusum Pan responsible for the imprisonment and killings at security offices. It's not because they had breakfast together. That is not our argument. They lived and worked together constantly by their own admission, the three of them, before, during, and after the DK regime. Most importantly, they were uh, the, te the most regular participants at the leadership meetings of the party, standing committee and central committee meetings, at which decisions were made, instructions given on arrests of purported enemies, including their fellow leaders. Kusum Pan and Noon Chea were two of a very, very small group of leaders who sat around the table at K1 and made these decisions. They sat around that table and they decided the fate of Nordam Sienu and his children, as you saw in those uh, standing committee meetings. They decided the fate of fellow leaders like Chakri and Chu. And Chu Chet, you remember Doik, who testified that Pol Pot invited Yusim Pan in lieu of Born Bet to the meeting that was to decide the arrest of West Zone Secretary Chu Chet. So it is their participation as a part of the very small group of center leaders who made these decisions that is one of the bases. And the second, and we address this in detail in our brief, the political education meetings and speeches they regularly gave to the party cadres in which they identified uh, which groups were considered enemies and they instructed the cadres to be vigilant, to constantly watch out and search for the enemies burrowing from the inside. Your Honours, uh, the Defence Council uh, told you uh, the Cambodian folk story uh, of the farmer who blames the goat for food eaten by a monkey because the monkey framed the goat by wiping the food on the goat's mouth. And I'd like to end today by telling you the democratic Kampuchea version of that story. Because it is truly fortunate for that goat that the farmer who found him with food on his face was not Noon Chea, Kusum Pan, or Pol Pot. They would not have just blamed the goat for eating the food. The leaders of the CPK would have smashed the goat for stealing the food, smashed the monkey for being part of the goat's network, and killed all of their offspring so the eggs of these enemies would not spread. And that is the sad reality of how things work in democratic Kampuchea. That was the callous disregard for life repeatedly shown by the leaders of this party. And it's a story I hope is never repeated in this country again. I thank you, Your Honours, for the time. And I'm now, you'll hear some concluding remarks from the National Prosecutor.
สมอกุลในสมกรุบโลปเทียนจากกรมแตงอ๋อเพียกีก็เราจะสาวนาคาแตงมูลทั้งไงนี่จะทั้งไงจงกรอยมองจงกรอยสำหรับสำนมเรื่องโซนโซนปีเอียติปีระบบสหประยาสหประยาเบียนจำนำอารมณ์บูจำนวนขนมระยะปีปัมปีทั้งไงกันรอหมดนี่กราบิสานสตับอาริยะเบใบทั้งไงกันล่ะในสาวนาการเลยกรมเมตวิกาเปียกได้บานตอบาคลังคลังถ้าสาวนาการนี้กรอนตายชีสาวนาการสำแดงแต่เป็นนกแต่นี่จะการโฆษณาโมยสำหรับเนี่ยความตัวบอตลาการเนื่องมันแม้นมีเจตนาจังรอกาปิดอมปีบอดจอประกันนุไลนขนมระยะเปปี้สัปดาห์ในสาวนาคาจิตซาทีระนันนี่เนี่ยเมียนเนี่ยโจรวมเทศนารอบร้อยเนี่ยในขนมสาวนาคาน้องมาสับสายตูเตียงสกอลกตามระยะประปอนอินเทอร์เน็ตเมเทวีกาเปียกได้ตรบานอนิยาอัยทเวออมนาอมนางรอบอกลุ่นออมปีเพียบตรมตรยุติทอในกาจุนุมจุเรียอัมพีเพียบตรมตรอยยุติทอในสิ่งใดสำราญตัวรบบอลโลกลุสไรจักรอมอัมพีจมหนักคลังในพอตั้งในขนมสำนองเรื่องนี้ดาวปมเบียนกาเชียดเชียดหรือกาตรุปินัดปีตุลาคาหรือปีนนามเนี่ยลอยตามระยะในดำนาคาจมนุ่มจมเรียโลกปฏิยันโลกจักรอมบ้านบางแห่งไปเพียบอัตมุตนักเพียบตรมตรยุติทอได้อันนิยาตอ่อยจนจอบจ้าวตามระยะเมธวิกาปีกได้ดอกบกวดเพื่ออมนาหอมนางจราจรตัวใบจีอมนาหอมนางนู่เมียนกาวีประหารตะลือสัจจะติดผิดดอกบาลูกจักรมก่อลูกจักรมเนื้อแต่ตาหลอกแกอ่อยเมธวิกาปีกได้เพื่ออมนาอมนางแต่งนิดดอกดนังอันนี้ยาดเอาเพื่อจะสร้างที่ระนาดเกียรติพองพิชิตชีวะเพียบอัตมุตนังเพียบตรมตรยุติทอระบาลโลกจักรมจำปุ่มเมตวิกาเปียกใดเตะโตนังกาวิประหารจีบกุลกัวตรบานตะตัวสกอลนองกำลองในกาเพื่ออมนาอมนางแต่งนิดในเปบัดกัดปีเพียสาดังดอลเมธวีกาเปียกใดบานบางฮานปีกาพยาอัลนังกาเป็นจัดระบอกล้วนจำปัวสาวในกาบันดังสาตกในสำนองเรื่องโซนโซนปีเวทีมวยแต่อัลรวยล้วนปีกาจับประกันพนายคลาในสำนองเรื่องมนุษย์โลกประเทียนโลกจะกรอมเยื่อมันเยื่อสลบตามสิ่งใดสำราญอย่างอ่อนุเตตามกาโรคเคยคลาคลาเตะตรงหนังอังสบาเจี๊ยบปีเซอองหายจะกาปิดนะยื่นปิดจะมีนกาเคาะจัดปนตายตัวจะยังนาก็ได้วิ่งมันอายนั่งมันแม่จะกางี้รบบอจะกรอมแต่เราเพื่อเอาเพียกี่ถึงออกสบายจัดนุตีกางี้รบบอลูกจะกรอมกืออันนวัจบับจอมปูอองหายเตียงหลายแต่บ้านรอกเคยดอยตรมตรยยุติทอหนึ่งสอบตามสเตสัมปันจะเนี่ยเราบอกลุ่นยื่นตะตัวสกอลในจำนวนนี่หายจะการปุ๊บนะยื่นตะตัวสกอลในการจุ่มเนี่ยจำพวกการลงบาดอย่างไรได้โลกลุกใส่จะกรอมจูบประเตะหนึ่งการเล็บบองเราบอกโลกลุกใส่จะกรอมจำพวกเพื่อระกัดอย่างนี้ขมิ้นนานมาเนี่ยบานอันซาเลกาบันดังสาตกแต่บ้านรอกเคยจำนวนอ่อนๆจะเจริญสำหรับจนจบเจ้าอาจเกิดท่าตุลาการนี้ตรบ้านบังการหลังแต่บ้านกำหนดลักพอลชีมลอยสาลิการะบบอองจำนวนจำเรียงวิสมัยน้องตุลาการกัมพูชีคือไอตะลืออองฉบับนังพ่อตังได้เมียนคณะได้สาลิกาเลือบันดังสาตกในสำนองเรื่องโซนโซนปีเวทีมวยบ้านรอกเคยจำนวนอ่อนๆจะเจริญ
để chui đào chân chọp chọp cọt đào ấy có sao để ca đấy ban đầm co tu lại ban tập tu squat thả ca tập tu khó tơ rập ban nuôn chi đằng kia sầm phòn chấm búa u cất cam tiếng đi tập ban mình chạy khuất pi bị mặt tệ sòng sài đằng ban tập tu squat thả sao vừa na cá bàn thưa là đòi trầm trồ giúp tịt thoa chìm mù lật thàn nâng sọp tam bát thàn on trạch chiết này ca chìm nôm chìm rẻ bạc cọp đòi giúp tịt thoa rom tiếc bàn đầm cao tu nâng thay ngay tim mà phê bầm bùn khai u sấp phía nam bị phòn đập bay đào mận đăng rót vạ vi ni mận nhẹ chìm mù hào chẳng tha bàn chìm rẻ lô bát thiên lô lục sợi ông pi cả bắt bóng xàm chắc cua xa rồi bắt quạt chầm nuốt mà phay pi nè nơi khăn ông rồi bỏ khăm ai cả hòm nâng tha ta bàn toa pi nô bật tất cả tiếng này bàn phá bỏ nông ca rô nơi rồi bỏ quạt bài nà thằng ấy đi khăn nhóm rồng phớp nà tại khăn nhóm miên ọc ca tam lại dạy tổ lạ ca ôn rạ chiến đi chỉ ca cho lòng cắt xa mốt đạo bay một đò tin đi nông ca xoay rồi dứt tiết thoa xâm rạp chôn rong cua nâng xâm rạp và chi chôn cam bà chìa tiền mồn lục xe rây ba này dễ thà nê cư chết thằng ngay đại khả nhóm bàn rong chăm ở rạp về chiêng xám sập chân nam mọc hào khả nhóm chóng xa nào xóm ai lô bà thiên lô lục xe rây tổ lạ ca ôn rạ chết môi nê trời tài xâm rạch sạch đầy bà cọp đòi trăm trời nâng dứt tiết thoa xong nâng phiếp thông thông ngô này bọt ở mơ Biết xa mạnh rộng bỏ lục xe rây Bạn mình chạy bí phía ra cách đọc thông xong bà Bạn tay đòi xa mọt trọng Nơi châm bùa mục lô bà thiên Lô chạc rõm Lô bà thiên lô chạc rõm Rồi thua cao vinh này chạy ở bàn trầm trời Nâng đòi dứt tiết thỏa Đòi bị chá ra nà bí bí xa lập phiếp đọc thông thêm Nâng tầm ngôn nây ủ cất cam tiền này nơi khăn ông cả rồi này, này ông chung chung rẻ rốt hơn tháng, bổ miên phó tăng hô phí vị mặt tệ xong xài nó, ông chung 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 rẻ miên sức bên lệnh, xong rách ở chân chọc cháu, rút luôn bị bọt cháu tiền nó. Còn tái, dương miên tùm nốc chặt thả, nơi bế đai lô bà thiền, lô chạc rộng, thừa ca bị nất tư lươi phó tăng nơi khăn ông xong nông rương đi, đòi dốc chắc tốc đạc, Lô bà thiên, lô chạc rõm Nâng khơi anh thả Khoa tăng tăng đi, bàn bọng hành Ai hút bì vị mặt tệ xong xài Hai ai tăng nuôn chi nâng khiêu xong phón Trời tự tua khó trời kháng bù mặt toán Trong bố ca thua ai ta chi tiết xa cò Và chi chôn cam bù chi rộp liên nạch Nơi khăn ông xa hạ cò Nâng nơi khăn ông ca tam ca rộp thà nền nía Đại bà chi chôn cam bù chi ạ bạn tự tu rong nơi khăn ông rộp bọp nô Chấm bố ông bố ạ mô nô sư thoa Tẹ đô nâng cô nơi dô bài xe đây bí ạ bí 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 đòi bằng khom Nâng ca rộm lộp xa hẹp xanh tế vẹ Đại chế phân hạch nơi cô nơi dô bài nê Chấm bố ca thua tục bọc nâng lưu bạc bốt xa kỳ nạch chốn Tẹ xa nạch chốn Nơi bế đại kê bàn rí rộp Công chát xa 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 chào trong bố ca thuốc thuốc bốc mà đành Nâng ông bố bà lại bố xa Tớ lưu cọm chân chết Việt Nam nâng chám Nơi khăn ông bà tích ca mà chìa Nâng trong bố ca không khá luôn nơi khó chấp áp Nâng ca thuốc tiêu rôn nạc ám Ca thuốc mô nô sức hiệt Nâng ca xâm lạp rong kia bà nục Bên vầy Nâng câu không mê rõ mơ nẹ Nì 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 dê trong bố tay mà tì xa nà sọc châm nôn bốn tay bà nọ Đại bán cháu bà c Ai kia xa tiền ổ Đã xa hạ bệ nhà bàn Dược một xong an nợ bình đi Sắp tại miền bộ phục trâm trở Mình đôi cho vậy Đại công mê thì vì ca biệt đầy bàn lực lăng thả Xa hạ bệ nhà bọn hành Ai kia xa tiền lái Nên xa xây nơi dưới của họ nô Cứ chìa ca mình trâm trở tỉ Ta xa hạ bệ nhà Xa xây Đã bận đăng rõ bạc bình đi Nâng nẹ chùm niền Bọn hành rưu thay lại mình bất nụ đám bầy ở vầy Lô bà thiên lô chạc rõm Nhưng xóm ai lô bà thiên nâng lô chạc rõm Thay lăng thay lại nhằm bí bó tàng Đói bóng bà giác Vì nê cháy đời dứt thịt hóa Nâng xóa anh rõ cà bật Nhi chí cà bật đài nâng bà đòi dứt thịt hóa Đói chân rõng cua 
นึกขนมสำนมเรื่องนี้เงินคือจะกาปิดได้ช่วยตอนมนุษย์เป็นไว้เอ่อไว้ขมิ่งนั่งมนุษย์จำนวนกล่าวนึกขนมปฏิกรรมปชีนั่งนึกขนมปิภพโลกแตงมูลส่งยื่นแตงออกเนียทั่วไอออกปิลัตเพียบตามใบตุบสกัดนึกอำเภอโคเคแบบนี้ก็เอาการเมียนลางไม่เชื่อมดองเตียนโลกประเทศโลกจักรอมสำนมเรื่องดิจีสำนมเรื่องดอกทมนังสมกสมังโลกประเทศโลกจักรอมบานสตาร์สไคกามรบสะไซจำนวนปีรอยจัดสับปมใบเนี่ยหนึ่งขนมสาวนาการนี้ขนมนุ่มเมียนสะไซมรอยจัดสับปีเนี่ยเนี่ยจำเนียนดอกมวยเนี่ยดาวมันดังรับปะเป็นอีกไก่สับปรามเนี่ยหนึ่งขนมกาจำนวนจำเรียจำนวนปีเลยจนจับจ้านวลจีนังเคียวสมพรการจุ่มนมจุ่มแรงนี้บานทั่วลางอรยะเปลบูนรอยกายสับปะบูนทั้งไงในทั้งไงสา